All right, only Sasquatch here. A little technical difficulties. Pushed the other record button and the video stopped. And I, just before I pushed record, I heard the same freaking noise right over there. All right, so Saturday, February 27th, just after noon. And I'm at the little entrance to the crisscross world here, the little rock quarry deal. I'm gonna try and get up here. I just wanted to put my gloves on in case I slip or something. I ain't gonna mess with the focus on my phone. And since it's snowing, of course, you're always looking for the elusive super track in the fucking snow, right? Just a definitive Sasquatch track in the snow. <sighs> that I haven't found yet. I found a lot of other tracks and a lot of other impressions. See, last time I was here. There we go. I just parked Numper right there. I thought it was zoomed out. All right, well. See what we can do here. I don't think this will be too bad. I forgot to bring those little things for my shoes. See, there's a break right there. Anyways, we gotta go. It looks different in the snow. We gotta go this way somehow. All right. Yeah, I don't know what you call those deals for my shoes, but you just slip them on and they're like, it's for traction in the snow. They're like these little wire deals. Filming left-handed. Don't stand there. Well, if I can get up there, this will be interesting. have to like double tap to check your step I don't know all right walking up rocks in the snow and on the hill oh yeah look at that I think I showed you guys that before it's like in a little bowl that little stick right there So yeah, those of you who don't know, or never seen my other videos, I call this the Sasquatch Crisscross World. When I get to the top, you'll see why. So pretty. Anyways, it'll take me a minute. I don't know why I'm trying to record me going up a hill, especially right here. I need my hands, just a sec. Holy moly, look at that. It's absolutely beautiful out here today. It's quite the little hill. Anyway, so yeah, I've been here before a couple times. And, uh, I found a track up here. There's quite a bit going on with the way the sticks in the woods are all over the place. You can kind of get an idea right here. It's kind of starting already. But, all right, I'm gonna need my hand, so I gotta push pause, and I'll talk to you in a minute. And I guess, I don't know. If it shuts off, this will just be part one. Or maybe this is part two already. Yeah, I definitely need to uh, use my hands just a sec. All right. Well, I made it up the hill. <laughs> you gotta go just to the left of that little tree right there and then down. 
Anyways, I needed both my hands. It's a good idea to maintain three points of contact when you're trying to climb some shit like that. <laughs> and I don't know, I got up here and like always you're like, huh, now I gotta go down. But that's usually how it works. Anyways, holy moly. See, I need to take these sunglasses off. All right. Well, I got to get up a little bit further, but this here is a Sasquatch crisscross world, and you're looking at it right there. It, it runs this little ravine right here. These rocks are kind of a pain when there's snow. You can't see what the hell you're stepping on. Huh. Look at that. I'm sure I've showed you this before. But that's something right there. It's a little. It's a break and a little leaner. And whatever that is at the bottom. It's marking a trail. I hope I don't slip right here. Anyways, the cool part about this is the road's closed and no one's been up here. And ideally, you find something neat. But, uh oh look, all in all, it's a beautiful day, and the weather's perfect, this looks slick right here, I think I slipped one time right through here, oh yeah. Right here. That branch is a bushwhacker. Tries to push you down the hill. There's two big breaks over there. Most of what is in here is done intentionally. And if you refer to my other videos, I think I have two. I got a couple anyways. About this spot here. And in the one I found a track. Which I already just said. See, look at this. It's just full of arches and breaks and things are crisscrossed and intertwined. Here, just a sec. All right. I haven't seen any, haven't found the elusive Sasquatch track in the snow. I got a little spider. Decided to tag along with me. I'm gonna put him on the ground. Good luck. It might be cold. <laughs> Anyways, so I made it up here. It's freaking gorgeous. If you look down here though, see there's the two breaks right there. There's actually three. There's a smaller one right there. The longer you look here, the more you see. I don't recall this tree being here. And then the super one is right there. Look at the twist on that. If you didn't know, that's the one that says, yeah. And then of course, there's whatever. This one, there's one right next to it. Try to get the angle from here. 
But yeah, this is quite the little spot. I don't know that anything's ever as cool as when you see it for the first time, but this is definitely something right here. Look right there. This branch comes down, tucked onto that deal. Makes a little fence. I just gotta watch when I'm walking. Hooey! See, what is this? Look at this. <laughs> Look at these sticks right here. And that little one sitting right there. It ain't much to look at, but looks like a little sit spot. And then, you can see, look how this is walled in. See this? Look at that. I don't even know if you can tell. All of this is put here. And then look at that double tree right there. That tree don't go there. That fork tree, that's just sitting there. And it's leaned up. See, all this stuff is touching. This is a little fence. This is a little fence. Hey look, somebody's track. All right, let me get out of here. Here's a little break right here. That's taller than me. <laughs> That's like seven feet. There's just stuff all over around here. See, even more arches. Look at that. I'm stuck. Look at this stick. Look at that. That's funny. It's just laying there. Laid up in there. Well, right on. I've been walking and talking and carrying this thing out of my in my hand for a while. I'm going to try and get you a view from down there. Or up here, looking down. See, look at this. Looks totally different in the winter. Right on. I'm not gonna go down in there, I'll trip and fall or something. There's sticks in the woods all over the place. But like I said, even right there, see those? Those ones right there crisscrossed. And that's all woven together down there. I talked about that in another video. I'm already this close, I'll go down here, I'll show you. Oh yeah, see, this is why I stopped before. Well, hell, I'm into it now. All right, just a sec. So, here's a break right here. Now, some of this is, you know, a lot of this stuff has been here. Some of it may be new, some of it's older. This one right here is hilarious. So, there's the break right here. And then this one goes up. And then it's looped and tucked underneath this big old tree right here. And then if you look at all this stuff, let's see, this big one goes out and underneath the tree. This little one comes like here. Well, hell, I can't point it out. But anyways, you see it. This one's arched and it's tucked underneath. This one's threaded right here. This is a whole little thing. All this. And if you didn't know, the tucked arch and the break would let you know. Hey, that's odd. See, look, dude. And then see how the other one is threaded underneath? It's a whole thing. And then it goes to this break right here. 
And then look at this one here. That little one right there goes underneath. It goes over to that one. I don't know if you can see it, but it touches that other little stick that wraps up onto that tree. And then it goes up. I'll have to go over there now, holy moly. Yeah, this is a whole thing, dude. I don't know, I said I wasn't gonna go in here, but here I am. Dude, look at these things. When these are broken, they're green, dude. This isn't because of rot, this is like sheer strength, I'm telling you what. Something just grabs these things and just manhandles them, dude. All right. So this little tree right here goes underneath, crosses right there. Goes right here to that little stick. Then it touches that tree, which goes up right into that little fork. Underneath, underneath, and then over that last tree. So it's kind of, it's woven through there and it's bent, dude. <laughs> Look, it goes like this. <laughs> I'm telling you, this is something. I, it, it's maybe not quite the same as when you first get here, but it's it's still something once you get into it. Holy moly. I don't know if I can, that's not a shortcut. I gotta go back this way. Hmm. All right. Go over here and I'll show you the super break. This is the one that's twisted off, and I'm telling you what, you tell me how the wind did this. See, look it. This is the shit I'm talking about. See how it's stuck right there in the crook of that tree? It goes under, under, and then right here. It goes over that one. I'm up on this little ridge. And then behind that one. How in the hell is that the wind? It ain't. And look at this. What is going on here? That's a hanger, dude. That don't go there. I can't even see where it goes. Right into that mess right over there. Huh. Seems like there's one spot I gotta watch out for up here. I can't remember. Oh, here's a tree right there. Maybe that's it. Right there. If I can see it right here. Look at this. Can you see the twist on that? I'll get a little closer. That's a big old tree though, dude. And that sucker is just twisted and broke over like nobody's business. I might shortcut out of here. I might go right there. See, there's another break down there too. There's stuff all over up here, I'm telling you. Oh, yeah. Look at that. There's another one. See, I gotta keep going. Once you get in here, you can't stop. You just have to keep going. Holy moly, look at all this. So yeah, look at that. I'm telling you, I got nothing to say. Look at it. 20 minute video. Oh shit. Look at that one. That one's twisted off too. And that thing, look at that. So that tree got twisted off and just happened to bend, bend right into it like that. There you go, it's a double twist break. And I'm 20 minutes into a video. All right, well, I think I'm gonna get right over here. I'll show you these. See, this is a triple. These are the ones I was showing you when I first came in. Only then, I was standing over there. 
But see, look at this. That one's even got a twist on it, dude. See that? And it goes all the way down there. And you got the, this big old one right here. This is broke. And then right, up, right behind that. Look, it's four. So, one, two, three, four. Crazy. Crazy, crazy. There's an arch, and that one there's tucked in. Right there. It's tucked in on the other side. Yeah, I don't know. This is just a whole spot. I'm glad I walked up here. It's a great day to be out walking around. It wasn't as far as I thought. And any day being out in nature is a good day. So I got no complaints. Well, with that, I guess I'll sign off on this video. I didn't know I'd been talking for 20 minutes. I walked you guys all the way up the hill. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for coming on a little adventure with me. And, uh... I mean, look at the size of this tree. That thing's huge. If you could just go ahead and twist that for me. All right. Well, until my next video, holy Sasquatch down here in Gifford, up here at the Sasquatch Crisscross World, walking around in the snow, walking where I said I wasn't going to walk. So, until my next video... Thank you all again, and uh, I don't know. Holy Sasquatch out. <laughs>